right, so you've got degenerative disc disease, right? This is a degeneration of the discs that are in the spinal cord. This can be easily overcome in time if a few simple steps are taken. Number A, we need to alkalize, all right? These little drops right here are electrolyte drops that will hydrate us if we put them in our water, tea, coffee, anything but a soft drink. Soft drinks will neutralize them, they will not work, but the electrolytes in there are like having Gatorade without all the extra crap. They're very, very alkaline. We don't put them directly on our skin or in our mouth. They have to be diluted or they'll take your fingerprints off. Um, MSM lubricates. It's the only thing we know of that actually can increase synovial fluid or it doesn't increase synovial fluid, our body does. See, if you want to cure disease, there's only one way to do it. Allow the body to heal itself. We can make conditions better and we can provide raw materials so the body can do its job. But if you don't have the raw material, you can't heal. You can't be cured. If you do not have the right conditions, you will continue to suffer with di dis-ease. This is a dis-ease or a disorder of things. Pretty simple. MSM provides the raw material necessary to create synovial fluid in the disc. More um, lubrication means less friction, which means less inflammation, which means less pain. But that's not the raw material. The raw material that is necessary to rebuild disc, bone, things like that, is found in ultra bone health. Ultra bone health is all the calcium, magnesium, potassium, phosphorus, boron, stromatum, everything needed to increase bone mineral density to regenerate those discs and give the body everything it needs. If you were to grind up bone and cartilage and put it in a pill, that's basically what we have there. Now, this works simply because the body likes to heal. We were made to be healthy, to live as well, forever, really, at our prime. The problem is, is when we do something that takes things out of order, like we are lacking one of the 74 trace minerals or one of the vitamins or one of the minerals, or we get too acidic and oxygen is not allowed in the system or something from the outside corrupts the system, then we have a disorder. And when things get out of order, degeneration happens and we start to have dis-ease in the body where we start to perish, right? So in the case of degenerative disc disease or osteoporosis, okay, or even osteoarthritis in many cases, um, what this is is just a lack of raw materials for the body to rebuild. We truly believe that the body rebuilds, and we've seen it many, many, many times. Your body heals itself. You cure yourself when your body's given the right material to do so. These are the right materials. Now, here's what must be understood. If you take something that is a painkiller, right? So you go to the doctor and you're like, hey, I got degenerative disc disease. He's like, oh yeah, take some x-rays. Yes, you do. And he goes, okay, what do you do about it? And he goes, well, we give you painkillers. You still have degenerative disc disease. You just don't feel it. And then it gets worse because now you don't feel it. To nullify the pain is to welcome more of the same. You keep doing what you've been doing. Here's how we reverse this disease. Number A. All right, you take your supplements, so you have the raw materials necessary and the right environment by alkalization and the lubrication. Then, soft drinks. If you shake it, if you take, it, you shake it up and it blows up when you open it, that's not a drink, that's a bomb. Soft drinks are 2.3 on a pH scale. What this means is our body has to pull out calcium, magnesium, potassium, phosphorus, boron, MSM out of our bones, out of our joints, giving you this osteoporosis, osteoarthritis, degenerative disc disease, da 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 da. Also making us more susceptible to things like cancer that live in acidic environments. Now, along with stopping soft drinks, 
the next thing to do is if we need to lose weight, we need to stop eating so much. We need to lose weight, get some dieters to light. You can watch a video on that. But weight loss is going to be important to not put so much weight on the discs so they can actually heal and regenerate. So you got the raw materials, you got that right. And then you stop the soft drinks, stop smoking. Smoking contracts the um, capillaries and blood vessels, so not as much blood flow. With less blood flow, you're going to not be able to get your nutrients to and from the bone. So you can't regenerate faster than you degenerate, right? So we want to stop causing things that cause restrictions in the capillaries. Um, posture is very important and exercise. Weight-bearing exercise, as much as you, you won't like it because you have degenerative disc disease, when we put extra weight on the bones, they start to regenerate. Same thing with everything in the body. If it's not needed, if it's not absolutely necessary, then the body gets rid of it. This is why muscle has to be constantly worked, but fat just hangs out because fat is stored energy. So we've got to get rid of the stored energy so we're lighter, right? This helps the working out, helps there. And then the muscles hold the structure of the spine the way it's supposed to be. So whenever you hold it together as it's aligned how it's supposed to, you can start to heal and then you lubricate with that right there. With More lubrication means less friction, which means less inflammation, which means once again, you can get stuff in and take stuff out without having that in, having to go around all the inflammatory response. Every 11 months, every soft cell tissue in the human body is replicated. That's muscle, muscle tissues, all tissues, organs, the whole nine yards, your eyeballs, all right? They're regenerated every 11 months. Now, every seven years, even the teeth have rebuilt. The hardest thing in the body. So what we're doing is every single day, and we're taking steps toward building our bodies and regenerating cells or degenerating. We die today and we are left in elk or incapacitated from degenerative diseases, meaning to degenerate. To stop degeneration, we simply have to take a few simple disciplines that are practiced every day will equal the regeneration of the cells, which will mean health. So with osteoporosis, degenerative disc disease, osteoarthritis, things like that, the number one thing is your MSM, your pH drops. Alkalize so that you stop taking so much bone, calcium, magnesium, potassium, phosphorus, boron, MSM, out of the bones and joints, we stop that from happening because your body won't need it to alkalize. You'll already be alkaline. And then MSM, which is methyl sulfonyl methane, which is going to provide elasticity, fluidity, oxygenation, lubrication to the entire, even the art cardiovascular system and the arterial walls begin to flex and bend and move more easily without cracking and bleeding. So it even helps to protect against heart disease. It breaks down every other nutrient you take, even medications. It helps them to break down properly so they don't get stopped up in the colon so that they get absorbed the way they're supposed to so things can work as God intended. See, God intended MSM to be in every single meal that we eat anyway. It comes down to rainwater, permeates all our fruits and vegetables, and it stays in there until after we pick them. About 12 hours after we pick a fruit or vegetable, what happens? It dissipates. So unless you're getting fresh fruits and vegetables, which you got to have a garden to do that year-round, then you probably should take MSM so your body can regenerate and detoxify the way God intended. This has the vitamin C to activate it, all the bioflavonoids, everything necessary for it to be just like it would be if we were eating our fruits and vegetables for MSM. So take that in the ultra bone health and it's gonna take about six months. It'll take seven years to completely rebuild the bones, right? But in six months, you'll notice such a dramatic difference that you'll know not to stop. 
Now, you could stop at that point, but then you're just going to either stalemate or degenerate. These are not in our foods anymore. Our food supply is devoid of the raw nutrients we need to live long, healthy lives. And that's because we only put three out of the 74 trace minerals that are necessary for our crops to make the vitamins that we need to be healthy. Because you put MPK in there to grow, and that excludes what? There's 71 trace minerals. 68 of the other minerals are left completely out of the soils or they're deficient. So it grows big, green, pretty crops because we're paid by the yield or the weight of the crop and we're not paid for how nutrient dense the food is, if you're a farmer, that is. So what we have to do is we have to supplement. When we notice a problem like this, we simply put these things in the body, give the body the opportunity to heal. Now, one other thing is we want to make sure that our hormones are there to tell the cells to rebuild and regenerate. Hormones are the dictators of how everything works. And one way to get our main master hormone up called growth hormone, which you really want that, um, to make everything perform properly is we need to do intermittent fasting, right? Or at least fast once every month for 24 to 48 hours. The reason being is this increases growth hormone. Growth hormone is the master hormone. It is what growth hormone injections are what all the movie stars take to keep looking 12 their entire life. And growth hormone when increased by hunger, which when we have extended periods without eating, we get hungry. That hunger releases ghrelin, causes the release of growth hormone. You can also do it through something called MK677, which you can get at a research chemical company, but it's not for human consumption, so you can't take it regardless. But Or you could take injectable growth hormone, but it really makes more sense to allow the liver and the kidneys to cleanse by stopping eating because those are the filters and you gotta put, stop putting things on them if they are to clean the filter. So um, be sure you do wet fast, like you wanna drink water. But um, if you'll do those things within six months, you're gonna see a dramatic difference within seven years, like you are completely rebuilt. But it probably took you, what, 30, 40 years to have this degenerative disc disease. So anyway, I thought that was interesting. I thought y'all might want to know. And thanks, Josh. Appreciate you. Peace.